with the chance of flooding, actually with the flooding we've seen, down trees and other related uh, damage tonight, we're finding ways to stretch your dollar. And DC News Now's consumer reporter and weekend anchor Ben Dennis looks at how you can save with a plan before filing insurance claims. guys good afternoon nobody wants to feel stiffed by those large insurance companies especially when facing ex emergency expenses from home related damage that's why we're taking a top to bottom look from rooftop to basement of how you can stretch your dollar the most on your existing insurance policy plus some repairs you can make while saving cash right now Leaky roof, shingles scattered, basement flooded. It's time to take plenty of pictures to document damage for insurance claims. Keep your paperwork, keep your receipts, document, take pictures of everything. While that's the start, you may consider hiring someone to assess the damage for you, a public adjuster. But before you do that, you may need some immediate repairs. Water in your basement, submersible pumps will help dry you out. This bestseller at Home Depot will cost you $124. But over at Walmart, the same one is $14 cheaper. Price check those essentials you need before you buy. As for those public insurance adjusters, are they really worth hiring? Most homeowners are going to benefit from using the adjuster provided by their insurer. If they're unhappy with the settlement amount, they feel like it's not accurate, or maybe they've had a catastrophic loss where they've lost their home and there's a really high payout amount, that's when they're gonna wanna look more into getting a public adjuster. Bank rate analyst Shannon Martin adds, homeowners should keep receipts, especially for any new items you've bought to help maximize your payout. As for getting more money back before the next storm. So if you need to get tarp, nails, wood to board up your windows, things like that, usually you will get that money back through your home insurance payout, regardless of whether it's a federal disaster or not. And if you're asking right now, well, what's it going to cost me up front? Well, renew your deductible. It's inside your policy. And Business Insider adds that if you do hire a public adjuster, they may charge between 5 and 20% of your final settlement, depending on that scope of work. But we found in Maryland that amount is negotiable according to state law. In the newsroom, Ben Dennis, back to you.